Hello everybody, so in this video I'm gonna show you how to download and install World Edit for Minecraft Java. So let's get started. The first thing you want to do is go to your web browser, and I will have links in the description if you need them. But here all you want to do is go to your search bar and search up mod winfax. So here you want to enter and now you'll see moderns that's come here. So just click on moderns and then you'll be on the moderns homepage. Here all you want to do is go on the top of the website to discover content and you want to go down to mods. Now all you want to do is go to search mods and you want to type in world edit. Here you'll find world edit here and all you have to do is click the name. Now all you want to do is go to the versions tab and then all you want to do is go to game versions and you want to select what game version you want to play. I'm going to choose the latest one they have. So 1.21.5. Okay. And here we have multiple options. So bucket, paper and spigot are for server and fabric and neoforge are for clients. So we'll be using clients here today. So we'll just be using fabric as well. So just choose a version for fabric and click the green download button. Okay. So now you should have world edit downloaded. And now all you want to do is go ahead and get yourself fabric. To get fabric, you want to go to a new tab and you want to go ahead and search up fabric minecraft. Here you should see fabricmc.net. Just click on fabric and this will bring you to the fabric homepage. Now all you want to do is go to the blue download button and then you want to go to the blue download for windows button here. And now you have fabric installer as well. So we have fabric installer and world edit for fabric. So all you have to do here is just click the close button for your web browser as we won't be using it right now. And now all you want to do is go to your file explorer and go to your downloads folder. So here all you want to do is simply go ahead and go to the fabric installer. So just go ahead and click that. And now you're going to have this little window here. So all you want to do is go to the Minecraft version and choose the Minecraft version you chose for world edit here. And as we did the latest one, we don't need to touch anything here. And you can just do install. Okay. And close. And now all you want to do is go to the Minecraft launcher. And from there, you'll be able to add world edit to the mods folder. So the way we do this is quite simple. We just have fabric loader here. And all you want to do is go to installations. Then you want to hover over fabric loader and go to the folder icon. Now all you want to do is find mods, which is right here. And you want to double click it. Now all you want to do is go to downloads. And you want to select and copy world edit. And you want to go to the top left arrow to go back to your previous folder and click paste. Here we copy pasted world edit to dot Minecraft mods. Okay, and once you do this, all you have to do is go back to the Minecraft launcher. You want to go to play, make sure Fabric Loader is selected, and click play. And you might have a little warning here, just do understand the risks, and click play again. And now, just wait for Minecraft to open up. Okay, and once we have Minecraft here, all you want to do is go to a single player world, so I'll just create a new single player world for that one. We'll just create a world and then we'll be able to start using world edit. You can of course use world edit on your ex existing world, but basically here, now we are, are in a new world and we can go ahead and play around. So what you want to do here is first get yourself a wooden axe. Now this is obviously changeable, but this is just the default tool for that. And here we have a wooden axe. So for example, if you try to break a block, you will not be able to, but it will say first position. And if we go all the way here, for example, it now says second position. So you right click and left click wherever you want to be. And once you have this area selected here, all you want to do is, for example, slash slash replace solid and diamond blocks. Huh? And now all solid blocks will be replaced in other Pretty simple thing, you can get yourself like a stick huh? or any other usable item and you can do slash slash brush, you can do sphere, you can do diamond block 
and you can make it size 5 for example. And now if you right click, you're gonna have a brush of size 5 of a sphere, very classic, that you can use to paint around. So yeah, that is something you can indeed do if you want. So yeah, that is how we get ourselves World Edit for Minecraft Java. So if you liked this video, make sure to like and subscribe, and see you for the next one. Bye!